when the Sustainable Development Goals were set up, one of the key things that came up was the need to go beyond survival and then think about survival, thriving and transformation of society. In the context of these goals, it's really important for every child to be able to optimize their potential. 250 million children are at risk of not achieving developmental potential. Additionally, it is estimated that 53 million children globally and almost 90% of them in low and middle income countries live with developmental disabilities and delays. African leadership in measuring brain health for children and adolescents, ALMA, is a consortium whose vision is to nurture the potential of every African child by training African scientists in the science of the young brain. We would like to train neuroscientists, people who understand the relationship between brain behavior. This is extremely important because really to transform societies, we must ensure we save the brain and we make the most of the potential for every person within the communities. One of the most important ones is how we can use neuropsychological and neurophysiological measures in assessing and identifying children who may be having developmental delays and disabilities. We can summarize our approach to addressing this in A, B, C and D. A is to advance the science of neuroscience in Africa, coming out with high quality research on neuropsychology, neurobiology, neuroethics. B is to build African research scientists and actually our consortium is very keen to mentor female African scientists in the field of neuroscience. C is to consolidate the institutional infrastructural support so that we can have high quality centers of excellence in neuroscience and three is really to drive the research culture through dissemination, engaging policy makers and engaging other stakeholders who would really be able to implement the work we do within government, within communities and have impact in our societies. We are very excited about the opportunities and I know that the consortium members are looking forward to making a contribution towards putting the African voice in the field of neuroscience.